good morning everybody this is uh, vo3 tango bravo romeo t balasubramanian from chennai i am pleased to present today my fourth episode on the digital mode of communication system and i had done first second and third uh, on the various mode of communication we especially talked about uh, pnet in one of the presentation which is a part of the digital mode and we had a good response from uh, many of us uh, the our registration goes uh, close to about 100 now and every day i see about two to three people are registering so we should uh, be going for a good amount of people using this uh, pnet today i want to present before you my second uh, good software it's called a blue dv david who is the same author of uh, pnet he has developed this uh, blue dv which works with a dongle called blue thumb dv uh, by him or dv mega stick 30 there are two type of uh, uh, dv dongle available to us apart from that there are a couple of other uh, dongles and uh, the pcb boards are available for various experimentation purposes and establish a qso okay let us go into the slide without wasting our time direct mode to digital world blue dv the software thumb dv the hardware the types of digital connectivity blue dv and thumb dv connect using digital usb dongle there are many players uh, in the digital mode uh, who have established their own protocol so let us take one by one icom and kenwood they introduced the d star which is one of the oldest uh, to start in the digital mode uh, followed by yesu uh, they have fusion and kenwood and icom they had uh, nxdn and uh, uh, pe25 by motorola and many others dmr by motorola initone uh, waxen tyt etc dmr is a great uh, in acceptance because of its various advantage and uh, operational ease and sound quality required items in order to start the uh, digital mode uh, the number 1 uh, and 2 is a usb dongle but uh, both are same but label are different one by thumb dv another is dv mega stick uh, 30 that is the name given to them this require only a pc and a software it doesn't require any radio or any other accessory but lot of people love to have the handy unless they have a handy they don't consider uh, anything like a radio so here is the zoom spot usb is an advanced radio model board which you can connect to the uh, pc or android machine then one side it has got a rf with a uh, 10 microwatt uh so it can uh, connect to handy on a vhf or uhf you have to specifically buy while ordering you want a uhf or vhf model okay so both are separate uh, two usb modules it supports uh, on a 32 arm processor it has got with a zoom spot fully assembled and tested it has it supports dmr p25 d star system fusion nxdn pos sag etc it cost about 120 us dollar so you can the plus the postage etc so one can buy this uh, also uh, if uh, they are interested to use uh, along with the radio here is the blue dv on a phone you see the android phone which is uh, connected to the otg cable and the dongle is connected to the otg cable 
similarly uh, the ipad uh, with uh, running uh, android with the otg you can work with the blue dv software digital networks we have a dmr d star system fusion c for fm they run a fcs and a ysf reflector nxdn they run a nxdn reflector i comment can you are the people p25 they run a p25 reflector with aapko ns nastd ncs pos sag adaptnet uh, like a alpha numerical uh, pager we used to have in the past then aprs messaging and location data forwarding services digital mode types and operators we have a satellite uh, type packet d star aprs nxdn dm dmr p25 sdr uhf vhf ssb fm am hf c c p25 rttty uh, like uh, with uh, dmr nxdn d star and fusion uh, the basically there are three types of user users repeater operator and network operator so there are three type of uh, categories let us uh, because uh, all the uh, protocol the some people call call this uh, rooms uh, uh, call it as a reflector some people call as a talk talk group and some, uh, some as a rooms so uh, we will go through each and every Uh, protocol what they are known by let us take first uh, d star uh, the dcs uh, room it is all with a prefix uh, dcs ref uh, stroke uh, d plus xrf uh, stroke uh, d extra xls and the people supporting are kenwood icom and uh, flex radio next is a uh, dmr protocol brain master uh, dmr plus dmr mark phoenix xlx so these are all the prefix uh, they use here the uh, uh, system fusion c for fm they use fcs ysf reflector they use the all reflector nxdn so nxdn reflector icom and kenwood uh, they are the supporter p25 uh, reflector apco nastd ncs and uh, possag uh, dapnet aprs uh, messaging and location forwarding here i am uh, showing the blue dv for windows so once it is uh, loaded this is how it looks when a call is uh, coming incoming uh, sorry when it is uh, transmitting it becomes red you can see it is in a transmitting mode so when it is uh, receiving it will be blue color so there is a bar given it gives you the strength and the uh, vu meter is also there so there are so many places for dmr d star fusion etc so presently it has taken dmr and d star so whichever the button you take uh, that uh, thing gets activated blue dv for android this is the link i have given for uh, going to the play store one can click and go and download the software blue dv for the android so this is the screenshot of uh, android how it looks uh, you know uh, when it is loaded on a uh, on a horizontal mode there is a ios also available blue dv but uh, the author has not uh, been developing because there is no much support from the uh, uh, the apple people they are very stringent on the communication system so whatever they are developed it is available in the market one can download but uh, it uh, it is got a limited uh, support for uh, protocols also only dmr and fusion only it supports so it doesn't support uh, any other uh, protocol so hardware uh, one can use iphone ipad etc so there is a software also called uh, i blue stack is there available so one can download that software 
this is a blue dv for linux so this is how it looks once it is loaded on a linux machine so dmr is pressed here so there is a communication going for dmr so you can see the dmr id for the person who it is called name and a call sign so all these three things are visible so it is very easy to do the communication and uh, knowing what is his uh, details etc blue dv linux this is a all the details are given what uh, protocol it supports uh, the what hardware it supports and also installation procedure how to go about it so one can go de in detail blue dv for windows this is how it looks here the screenshot for fusion you know once it is uh, if we taken a fusion you can see c for fm is uh, taken with the call sign the name of the person and the info that is uh, what information about the dmr or the fusion registration code number here the last heard you know over as called so last heard the, the call sign time all those details are given here blue dv for window the all the details given what are the protocol it supports so what are the hardware it supports etc so you can go through this here the link to shop to buy thumb dv or the dv mega stick uh, zoom ambi board so all the shop details are given so one can go and buy if one is interested to buy here is the blue dv for windows the window setup uh, page is uh, displayed here you have to full full the uh, call sign then the dmr d star registration and uh, the qth location grid all other details uh, need to be filled in and saved so that uh, the server recognizes and gives out the information to whoever it is required or it is calling so all information should be filled and saved before using it here also it's the same setup page uh, you know what it is uh, to be filled more in detail it is given here here is the blue dv nora interface nora japanese uh, one of the repeater that this diagram gives what are the different options available using the blue dv on android on a computer and also on a ambi server so it gives you the full picture so our next slide uh, will explain more in details here it is a uh, this is a ambi server which is a portable uh, in nature if you install this uh, with a wifi connectivity uh, one can make a call from phone from any part of the world so from this ambi server to dmr d star etc so it's a remote location possibility of calling is available uh, so this is a ambi server uh, which is available from japan using uh, blue dv one can employ various hardware combination that you have seen but there are also some server which can be used for remote operation and use mobile android software to call our server and through which we can initiate the dmr d star fusion mode etc we will discuss in our next few slides due to our time paucity we may not be able to go into detail but can get in touch with the presenter using his contacts i'll read out the what is the ambi uh, this uh, chip is it's a very important digital voice system ambi 3000 Vcoder chip is an extremely flexible voice compression solution that sets a new standard for quality, high performance speech compression hardware. The Ambi 3000 Vcoder chip is a DSP based vcoder that provides exceptional voice quality at rates as low as 200 bps. The Ambi 3000 Vcoder chip offers the functional affordability and mobility required by virtually all full or half duplex mobile communication devices its superior performance and flexible design configuration make it an ideal choice for commercial 
consumer and military communication applications. In other words, the chip can convert PCM audio to and from digital voice, DMR, DSTAR, Fusion, etc. So this is one of the best chip uh, uh, MB3000 which you can find in our dongle. This is how a PC MB3000 stick can be connected uh, to the PC and to using a headset with a mic and speaker one can uh, establish a QSO. This is an advanced uh, zoom, uh, zoom Ambi board. A Zoom Ambi board is made by Jim KI6ZUM. It is very dynamic. The board can do serial, Wi-Fi, Ethernet. You can connect to an OLED to the board to see the status of the board. Example, IP address, Wi-Fi, RSSI. Uh, the board does not have operating system, so does not need any uh, OS patches, etc. On the following website, you can find more information about this board. So this can be used for an advanced, uh, you know, projects. Uh, you know, so the details are given there. Uh, what is it board? How to configure? What sort of uh, you know firmware application need to be uh, loaded into this, etc. This is the one I was mentioning about Ambi server. This product is made by Japanese XLS uh, Reflector Club. Uh, so the so and so call signs. You can connect the Sandy device to your Wi-Fi network and use it remotely with the blue dv android or windows on the following website you can find a lot of very nice documentation about the, this uh, device so this is a very beautiful uh, i was also trying to import this uh, ambi server but uh, japanese they were not able to uh, ship this for want of uh, the clearance from the indian post office they are not accepting uh, till now so maybe if they open in another one or two months, then I'll import this one so that I can use it for my remote operations. I can keep this server running uh, in Chennai, but when I travel any part of the world, I can call using my IP address. Through this, I can call the DM, DSTAR, DMR, etc. I only need a internet connectivity and a blue DV software. That's it. This is so powerful Ambi server. So one can use this as a second part of uh, the project work. So that will conclude my uh, speech on this uh, digital mode. Hope you enjoyed my all the four series on the digital mode of communication. And the PNAT and now the Blue DV both make it as a one of the best mode of communication. One is using the server of the PNAT Second is going directly to the gateway of DMR, DSTAR, etc. So I would ask you everybody to go and check and try out this software and happy to do the QSO worldwide basis and test out the various chat rooms, reflectors, etc. So one day the digital is going to take over Maybe the RF, uh, I don't know how long it will sustain and may will land up uh, in the picture what I'm showing. It may not be, but uh, there is a very good possibility the way the digital is uh, moving. So, 73s and thanks for uh, attending and listening to me patiently my presentation. Thank you. Take care. 73. Bye-bye.